Beyond West Texas is the Trans-Pecos, Western West Texas. This is the region west of the Pecos River stretching all the way out to El Paso and home to some of the most dramatic scenery in the state. On the northern fringes of the Chihuahuan Desert, its vast plains and dramatic mountains are inspiring and gorgeous. The Rio Grande marks its limits to the south and west, the Pecos River to the east, and the New Mexico Line to the north. Big Bend National Park is part of the Trans-Pecos and boasts some of the most unique and inspiring terrain in the country. The tallest mountain in Texas is also in the Trans-Pecos. That would be Guadalupe Peak, just barely inside the state line from New Mexico, where it sits majestically above the Chihuahuan Desert all around it. El Paso is the most important city in the Trans-Pecos. This metropolis has always had a unique position in the history of Texas. Originally, the city of El Paso del Norte is what we would now refer to as Ciudad Juarez in the Mexican state of Chihuahua. Even so, the Spanish named this stretch of the Rio Grande El Paso del Norte because the river pointed the way north through a string of mountains. It marked the end of the arduous passage across the unforgiving Chihuahuan Desert and into the relatively abundant grass and water of the Rio Grande Valley of New Mexico. The first Thanksgiving in American history probably took place in El Paso because the Spanish thanked God that they had finally reached the Rio Grande. The American city grew into the name, while its Mexican counterpart took the name of a great Mexican patriot and president, Benito Juarez. There are other towns in the Trans-Pecos worth noting. Pecos, Texas claims to be the birthplace of the sport and art of rodeo. There are the Fort Towns, Fort Stockton and Fort Davis, along with Van Horn, Alpine, and the resort town of Lajitas. Now these are towns, not cities, and travelers are wise to fuel up whenever these places come into view.